Hey guys, it's the Xbox Nut. Uh, we're going to do a bit more on the display again. I think I'm going to put... Oh, oh, this isn't the... Uh, this isn't the texture pack that I like using. Naughty Ollie. Yeah, so we're going to do... I think we're going to put a counter in. Now, before I... Before I... Voice crack. I finished off the... the bleh, bleh, bleh. I'm going all over the place today. I finished off the decoder. Zero to nine, uh, one to nine plus zero. I don't know. I tend to put the zero at the end. I don't know why. But we're going to try and fit the counter. Oh God! Jesus Christ! Try and fit the counter. I'm going to use my boat design again, and I'm bear with me on it though because. Uh, Although it is my design of the actual counter, I th obviously Etho, Etho's lab uh, contributed to it because he gave me the idea for it. But there is no literal schematic of it, so I'm going to have to be improvising. I got some... This is basically what you need. Pressure plates, doors, ladders, water. Uh, you won't need 64 of all of them, but you need, I think, about 10 ladders. These are just for mistakes. 10 ladders, 10 pressure plates, a lot of water. I think 20. Basically, two per, two per digit plus a bit for the beginning, and then pressure plates for the uh, the reset. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to make this a bit bigger because the further away it is, it's not pressure plate next to each other. So you can't put it right here because they have to squish together into here. So if you imagine, it will probably be from about here to. It's quite long, considering there are like ten of them about over there somewhere and you can't squish them all here in that small space so it's easier to do it further away so I'm gonna extend this and I'll stand here and look at the top of that tree and when the next screen is up you will see a lot of ground being made This was after one Minecraft night. Just this, really. It took me quite a while to do that. And this is after about a couple of minutes in the day. God. What I'm going to do is I'm going to start it now from back here. And I'm going to improvise and see and hope that... If we do need some more space, I'll just clear some of that out. So I'm not gonna dig it. I'm not gonna dig down mainly because it's hollow, isn't it? I just made a base and oh my god and um, animals like to jump in. So by raising it up a level, it helps to keep animals in. So. Let's start right in the corner. Should we start in the corner? Look, squids. Yeah, let's start in the corner. So, from my design, I think it's four. One, two, three, four, five, six. Like that. Mm. Doors and ladders. Okay. Nope. Doing it with a pickaxe makes it surprisingly faster. Once you get it back. I think... I think that's the general design of my old counter. What was here? Nothing. Yeah, so this is the main dock. Just like that. And then... Uh... How are we doing for time? 
Okay, so we're five minutes in. Ah, uh, how did it go? Oh god, I'm gonna need more space on the side. Fuck. Car, stupid cow. Okay. We'll worry about the water later. I'm not sure how long that'll be. I'm, I'm wondering if it's shorter than I think it is. If it is, I'll be pretty pissed. And I might run the wires underground. Oh, that'll, that'll be crap, though. We'll see. We'll see how long they are. Okay, so. If I remember correctly, where are my ladders? It goes... Three spaces between each door. One, two, three. Um, this is all from memory. Uh, ladder there. Pressure plate. So, eight, seven, six, five, three, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Looks about right. Obviously, it shouldn't do that. That's wrong. Uh, I just did some stuff off camera, and I, you know, I just took away the pressure plate and replaced the water, and it worked fine. I'm not going to bother with the other side at the moment, but I'm pretty sure this is the right layout. This is eight. I think, or nine, and then it goes to zero. After that I need, and then it's it's pretty a length. Um, so I've just been doing the doors. Next I'll do the pressure plates. Make sure it's not in front of it, or beside it. I, for I completely forgot I was trying to help you uh, make this. So, the idea that the pressure plate is next to the door, so that it activates whatever you want it to press when the boat's on it, which we're going to put in later. But it doesn't open this door, because otherwise it will def uh, defeat the whole point. The point of the door is that when we put redstone to it and flick a switch, it will open all the doors at once, no matter which boat one the boat is. Let's say it's here. So number five, whoop, go through, land on number six. And then it's a counter. Is that the right amount? Is that the right length? Seems a bit long. Anyway, we'll find. I, I'll, I haven't. I have a good way of finding out. In fact, I can do that now. I just all I remember is that it's a nice snake pattern of the water. God, parents. Uh. So the next water should go here. And that's right. So it's like a nice snake pattern, so it's out and in and out and in. And this is, this is where the water goes. So this is the right design. I've just pretty much confirmed it. Pressure plates. How, how. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So that's 9. And ladders next to the doors to prevent the water going back. One, two, three. Okay. Uh, it's getting pretty long, the episode. So what I'm going to do is, when we get back, uh, I will have made more space over here, 
have the water spaces coming out and hopefully you get the idea so I'll give you probably a summary right now because I don't think I explained it very well boat goes in here the two currents push it in the middle so they doesn't smash or anything and it just goes straight to the door to the door this water combined with the water that will be on the other side both have a length of eight blocks towards where the boat needs to go so it's even so again it will just flow straight land on the press plate sits here holding it on number one or whatever when you press a button or you have a counter crap oh, I didn't mean to do that door will open get off on number one go to number two go off number two go to number three go to number three go to number four so it's the counter out something like that yeah so you get the idea you're smart people. Sorry, there hasn't been a video in a while. Uh, I've been, the lag has been annoying, and I've been doing a lot of redstone stuff, and it does get a bit repetitive. Um, so hopefully, you can understand me taking a break. I only just realised that it might be too dark for you to see, and oh my god, I, I'm, I'm not going to record this whole thing again. But you probably get the gist. You've seen it in my other videos. Yeah, okay. Thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you next time.